Hey yo, what is up guys, it's me, Paulo Gonsalves here, back with another video. So before we actually get into this, I can already see people down in the comments section like, Oh, you're playing Minecraft, oh, Minecraft is dead. Well, I've been playing it and it's actually quite good, you know, but still a bit dead. But, um, so, um, today we, I am bringing you five builds that you can build in Minecraft with no add-ons or mods so first of all we are building a lantern which is uh, and I've already prepared as you can see and this is what we're gonna need we're gonna need a lever we're gonna need an orange banner red dye an ink sack a crafting table and a redstone lamp that is all you're going to need and um, so first of all you're going to place down your crafting tables anywhere it doesn't really matter and then you are actually going to open it now what you're going to do is you're going to add your orange banner onto the crafting table but you actually add it on the lower bottom of it in the middle yeah like that and then you make an upside down Y shape with with the red dye, so you get this orange uh, red base gradient, which looks really good. And then what you're gonna do, you're gonna add your uh, orange banner in the middle, and then you're gonna um, you're gonna add ink sacks all around it, so you get that black border. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna use your redstone lamp, and then you're gonna pr um, insert your lever down and turn it on. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put your new banner all around the of the redstone lamp as as you can see and yeah check this out guys this design just looks absolutely amazing to me it works and the and when it actually comes tonight it's actually so amazing trust me now we are going to build number two which is a lamp so a lamp doesn't require a lot, but if you are in survival, it's gonna it's gonna take you quite a few things, um, and it's gonna be quite of a job to actually get them, which consists of dragon egg, and that that's not easy to find. So you're going to need a sea lantern, a bone block, a dragon egg, some quartz slab, and stairs. So first of all, what you're gonna do is you're gonna place your quartz stairs upside down like so and like that oh uh, i've actually done a mistake here oh i've, I've done a mistake uh, you actually you can do it as long as as you want as long as there's a middle bit now you add in your dragon egg and then you can either use your sea lantern which actually looks okay and it provides you light but if you do use your bone bone block it looks way better but it does not provide you any any source of light so now we are moving on to our next build, which is a different plant design. This design is quite okay, like low in resources, I guess, but still a bit tricky to do. So you are going to need to pay attention to what I'm about to say. So first of all, you're going to dig two blocks down, so, uh, as so, and then you're just going to build like a four, four, three ish tower and then you're going to place five arm stands in different positions so, like so so i'm doing it from like different same different angles and then doing it from the side and then doing it from the side again now what you, now what you are going to do is you're going to need to like cover all that in so that you only get like the top bit of the the arm stand so what you are going to do is you're going to get a double arm a uh, double piston system which also may not be needed i think it works with one piston i actually never tried it out but it could work and uh, so now what you're going to do is you're going to activate the the first one and then activate the, the top one which didn't make any difference that's why i think the like and then you activate that again so you get that and i actually did equip the the arm stand with them with a grass block by mistake so my bad and um now what you're gonna do is you're gonna get your your leaves and then like go as high as you want in any that type of uh, shape you want and boom look at that does that not look good to you guys come on that that that, that looks that reminds me of um 
Marge Simpsons. Uh, Marge Simpson. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we are moving on to the beach design, which is build number four. So you are going to need four types of color beds. So I went for green, yellow, orange, and red, which I personally think it's better. Gonna use any type of fence, and then you're gonna need the most orange trapdoors ever. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna place your fences three box up, and then build around a square it be any type of block of your choice it doesn't it really does not matter it could be any block and now what you're gonna do is you're going to place the bed so you please make sure you do not make the pillars t touch each other that should not happen um, tr please try to avoid that otherwise it'll just look very bad then you just add your slabs then you um, then you delete all the, the blocks that you placed around Till you get that as you already can see it it's a look it's a look it looks amazing now you're gonna add the trap doors like so it, it is important that you put in the same position as me and then you do this and then you activate one of them so it will look like this check that out guys does that not look a really cool that I really recommend this for a beach design or just like a very cool back garden and um, yeah I really recommend it Moving on to our last build of the day, which is a really cool barrel design. So you are going to need a hay bale, water bucket, and a um, spruce trapdoor, which is really low in resources, I think. And um, this build is just really gonna look amazing, trust me. It's gonna be cool for, like, to give your horses and stuff. So first of all, you do like a flower shape with, with the, your trapdoors, like so. It is important that you do it the same way I'm doing, and then you activate them, like so. Now you can either add your hay bale, or you can add your your water. So I am going to do two examples, just so that you guys can see. So flower, and then water. And this design actually can also be a really cool decoration design for the water, because look what happens. Not sure if it works with lava, but it might. And look at that. Isn't that just really, really cool design? It also looks really cool as a decoration. And personally, I really recommend it for like anything really. That's it for today guys, I hope you did enjoy, drop a like and subscribe for more content.